Great. So we're coming to the end of the uh, the the uh, the day, but we do have an in-studio guest with us before we go to the conclusions, and it's uh, Bengt Nilsson, CEO of Hammerglass. Bengt, welcome to the studio. Great to have you here. Thank you. Uh, you began your career in the marketing sector, actually, and uh, you spent several years as a project manager at a market, marketing agency. That's true. And while you were there, you got in contact with a product called Equinova, and it's inventor to Bjorn Olsen. Yes. And in 2006, Equinova was renamed Hammerglass, and Bank took over as CEO of the newly formed company. And today, Hammerglass Group has a turnover of 10 million euros and 60 people with subsidiaries in Norway, Denmark, Germany. And your operations are evenly distributed across the business areas of real estate, infrastructure, and automotive. So, what is Hammerglass? What What do you What do you have What is Hammerglass? Um, I thought I'd start off by, by showing the frame that was used in the film. We'll correct. start with that. Yeah. Um, this is a model of the steel frame used in the film. It's called RABS, after the different tests that has been, that has been tr through. It consists of a steel frame, as you see, yeah. and of <coughs> two paints of hammergloss. Hammergloss is a special, uniquely coated Polycarbonate, mm -hmm. 300 times stronger than glass. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, the 12 millimeter inner pane here in the uh, in the frame is bolted into the steel frame. So, and, th and the steel frame itself is bolted into the um, to the grill brackets of the cabin. Mm -hmm. So it's instead of normal steel grills. Uh, it has been tested with full FOPS level 2 tests. It has been tested with um, 3 kilos of TNT. 3 kilos, three kilos of, TNT. of TNT. That's enough three to bring down a building. Absolutely. And <laughs> at, at 3 meters range. So this will withstand anything that's thrown at the cabin. Okay, so with the w what what industries would need that level of protection? Now? Would that be the mining industry? The mining. Demolition. Um, yes. And uh, not at least uh, in, in, in uh, quarries, road builds where there has been explosions, mm -hmm. and there might be undetonated explosions, uh, explosives in the, in the storm masses. Right. So while handling them, they, mi they might go off. Really, really interesting. We saw people hammering on glass uh, in the videos. Uh, how do we know the glass survived? Well, the <laughs> the, the the inner pane, as I said, is it. Yeah. 12 millimeter hammer gloss yep. to protect that paint from um, uh, the shrapnels of, of hammering, for yep. instance. There is a sacrificial screen on the outside. Mm -hmm. So the sacrificial screen was the one taking the, the, beating. Blood, the, the, beating. the beating. And <coughs> I mean, in fact, I brought it here. This is the same screen that was used. This is the one. The one. As you see, it's taken a lot of beating. And this is only a four millimeter hammer gloss. And it's uh, supposed to take the, the beating from, from uh, the stones and chips and windshield wipers. And it's supposed to be replaced once a year in tough environments. It's mm -hmm. cheap, it's replaceable, it's easy to replace. But not broken. I can attest that it's bumpy, but not broken. Exactly. Very good. So this is for really tough environments. Yeah. Um, but for more normal standard environments, yeah. we will replace the normal screens with uh, an 8 millimeter hammer gloss. Mm -hmm. So we have seen through the tests that these will endure anything due to the steel frame and everything. Mm. And I've uh, brought a little surprise for you. I yes, I like surprises generally. Have here, this is what we normally would replace a normal standard glass in a cabin. Uh, mounted just as the, the other glass, a uh, normal glass with, with glue. Yeah. And you're free to try to break it. Oh, challenge accepted. Let me just unbutton my jacket here. I'll try to hold it. You hold it. Everybody standing back. Hammer of the gods. Here we go. Hammer time. Okay, we. Uh, I think I could do it if I had enough time. <laughs> <laughs> but with the time we have, let's see. Look at that. Just a few marks. 
Yes. Yep. No cracks, just a few marks. So, so this is what we would use as a replacement gloss. So obviously this product is all about, the benefit of this product is all about uh, safety. Yes, it is. And, and, and of course, economic as, as well, because you don't want the downtime cost when the, when the s machine stands still and, and uh, the cost of the broken gloss. Yep. And of course, the safety of the driver. You're, you're also in the, the infrastructure area. So how does hammer glass products fit into that in infrastructure sector? I don't really We use uh, hammer glass for um, uh, sound walls, mm -hmm. for bridges, for um, train stations, and of course for bus shelters. Bus shelters, yeah. So we're in fact launching our own unbreakable bus shelter uh, <laughs> Fantastic. This, this year. So this is currently being used very much in forestry, correct? Yeah, that's the strange thing you see, because there are, I think it is 1.2 million construction machineries sold in, 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 uh, globally every year. Almost all of them comes with normal gloss, yep. puffing gloss or laminated gloss. And in, in um, the forest industry, all of them comes with polycarbonate. Mm -hmm. And I, don't, I can't explain why. Yeah. Because uh, the risk of, of, of being injured by something flying at your, your cabin is uh, quite extensional. And, yeah. and, uh, and it's a bit like having a seatbelt, right? You don't, you don't think you know, about your seatbelt until you really need it. Yeah, you very know, maybe few. Maybe only once or twice in your life you really, really need it. Yeah, it's almost... And you wear it every day. Almost uh, unnecessary. Yeah. Just like uh, a safe screen. You want to come home safe from a job. You want to come home safe after a car travel. So uh, my... My focus, my, my vision of, of uh, this is that uh, in, in 10, 15 years, almost all construction machines will have a polycarbonate solution instead of gloss. Fantastic. Bengt, thank you for your support of the event. And thanks thank for you. being here with us. Thank you. Thank you.